Hey, I'm Alex and I paint tiny things. I'd like to talk about adding your base layers today. After your primer has dried, your first step is going to be putting down your base layers. When I talk about base layers, really, I'm just talking about the blocks of colour that form the general areas on your miniature. You can base everything in its relevant colour first, or you can tackle one area at a time, finishing each before moving on to the next. It's really up to you. My recommendation is to start with the innermost detail on the miniature. That's the element or the elements with the hardest to get to areas. This will probably be things like underclothing or skin, but you can easily find these areas just by looking and seeing how difficult it might be to get brushes into and around those areas. A base layer is the first one or two coats of paint you add to your mini on top of the primer. The key to a successful paint job rests on getting good coverage here without obscuring too much detail. That can mean thinning your paints of course, but this is not a one-size-fits-all solution. Lighter colours may need to be thinned less, certain paint brands will be more heavily pigmented than others, so this really is about understanding the paints you intend on using and getting used to how they behave as you apply them. Generally, at least a couple of coats of paint are required to fully cover your primer, but don't be afraid to apply more coats if the paint is thinner just to get that solid base colour. Once you've got that at a point where you're happy, you can move on to layering and highlighting or washes and shade paints, both of which I'll cover in subsequent videos. 